Final Fantasy XIV Online. Have you ever been in a dungeon where they chose to kick somebody from the group? Maybe you've been kicked from the group, or maybe you disagreed with the decision altogether. Stick with me, because we're going to talk about that today. Hello, my wolf pack. Thank you all for watching. And yes, today is not going to be a how-to video. It's actually discussing the choices that people make when they kick someone from a group. Recently, I'm going to own up to this. I was actually kicked from a group, which, you know, I shouldn't have to own up to it. It's embarrassing though, okay? So what happened is, is I was going through the DLC. We just had a DLC drop, Endwalker, and I went into a dungeon, and it is in the storyline progression. And I had, and I told them, I was new, this is my first time, clearly almost everyone's gonna be new, but they had already hit 90 or something like that, and you could tell by they were maxed out and that little circle around their, their um, you know, level was there. So they had been through the dungeon before, they were on their A game that day, and yes, you are awesome. How awesome is that? You're on your A game, and you kick someone from a group who said they were new, and you pull a mass amount of mobs all the way to the boss and you wipe and it's the healer. Yes, I was on my healer and the scholar and whoa, how awesome are you that you kept running away from Eos? You know, you kept readjusting and things like that. It's crazy, but you know, so okay, they, we wiped, they get up and they run and proceed to do the whole thing. How is the second time gonna be any different from the first time? Now I'm sure this tank and these people had their reasons for doing it and they could probably have the other side of the coin as far as what I just explained. Oh, this healer was horrible, they kept, you know, we died twice, you know, blah, blah, blah. You know, so there is always two sides to the coin. But the thing is, is like, especially in this circumstance, everyone is going through that DLC. Why would you kick anyone from a group when they said they were new? When they said they didn't, you know, I mean, like they wouldn't know the mechanics, they wouldn't know what to do. And how about the fact that you may be typing on a keyboard and you can type however many words a minute, but you are playing with PlayStation 4 and 5 players who type off of a controller and you expect them to answer quickly? I mean, come on, really? Okay, so then how about you also think about the fact that, you know, um, you're kicking someone because they don't meet your standards of gameplay? Well, who are you to actually do that when in fact, the choices for kicking a player in, in this game are being AFK, offline, harassment, or cheating. Those are your choices. So the people that kicked me and the people that kick other players because they're not up to par for them, you know, lied. They actually lied. And this is a, if, if I had chosen to be someone to report that, it's a bannable offense right i'm um, we're not even going to go into that but you know there are a consequence for your actions or inactions now for those of you who are in the in a group and someone initiates kicking even if they're your friend you know don't just jump off the bridge because someone else is jumping off a bridge i mean you know think about that human being that person that isn't you know that you were kicking just because they didn't get something right they haven't done it right I can understand like if if it's just not happening and you know you're going through a dungeon over and over and and it's just I mean it's a horrible experience in a sense I could kind of understand that maybe you would ask that person hey you're just not getting it you know could you would you mind you know just like stepping out or leaving or why don't you say something like owning up to it and saying, listen, this is totally frustrating, we're out of here. And you leave, you take that 30 minute penalty for leaving the dungeon without everyone voting. Or how about you vote to leave better than anything else? You vote to leave, vote to disband the instance, you re get your job done without that person that is so offensive to you that you can't finish it. And yes, I am being a little bit harsh, but it's a, it's, it's a reality. There's, you know, this community for Final Fantasy XIV Online is awesome, but we've had a surge of new players. And I'm not pointing a finger at any direction at all as far as those new players. I'm just saying that they're just, you know, they're, they're less patient, they're less kind. And, you know, I mean, like, we are a, play, a, a community of kind players. We help each other out, we explain things, and we're understanding. 
So why not just try and, and remember that you're no longer in a game that is nasty to each other. You're in a game where we actually want to help you. We want to help each other. And quit just losing patience after one wife or, or two wives and kicking somebody. I mean, imagine if this was your mother, your father, your sister, brother, boyfriend, girlfriend, your husband or your wife that was being kicked and talked to and treated to like, you know, like the way that you are treating these other players or that they're being treated, you know, don't agree with someone just because they want to kick someone and maybe think twice about kicking someone from a group because the next time you do it could be the time that you get reported and you get banned. You know, and after so many times, maybe you're, you don't even get to play the game anymore. Let's just all have fun and quit kicking each other and help each other out. How about that? This is Mystic with Mystic Shepherd Gaming. So remember to smash that like button, ring the bell to be alerted, and hit subscribe. Take care, my wolf pack. I will talk to you next time.